every single time it is this time of the month we all say it as youtubers where did the month go but that is really how i'm feeling although i'm very happy to see february go on out and have march come in because i'm ready for spring i don't know about the rest of you because it has not been a nice winter around here so we're going to get into what i was enjoying the most this month my favorites and i'm going to get into those right now for you guys all right, so we're gonna get out of the way ColourPop. I have ColourPop in every single favorites video and this is no exception. This one is came out around Valentine's Day and this is the U U-R-A-Q-T palette. And this is exclusive to uh, Ulta, I believe. I don't think they have it anywhere else yet. They might have it on their website now. I really enjoyed this. I loved having, of course, the lavenders, but you do have some neutral tones over here. And then you have these gorgeous metallics that are all through here, and they all just look really beautiful on. Of course, ColourPop's formula is one that I am in love with that I'll continue to promote just because it is one of those that is just that good. And the colors in there are so easy to blend and they're so pretty. And I loved that they gave you kind of just a spring pink palette but they also gave you the opportunity to go into the neutral colors if you wanted to so you could use any of these colors along with the neutral and you come up with just some beautiful looks and I did a look this month um, that I did on camera not that I did on camera for a tutorial but I had on camera where I was using this palette and I used all of these colors right here but I incorporated some of these and it just turned out really beautiful so again ColourPop does a really good job with their palettes I was really good that's the only palette that I bought for the month you guys so I feel really good about that right now <laughs> and then from ColourPop also I know I think I mentioned this in my last favorites video but I want to mention it again because honestly you guys this big huge pan of the super shock formula is so pretty and this is in your catch and i purposely did not put a bunch of highlight on today because i want to put this on just to show you guys first of all there's a humongous mirror in here this is a big pan if you guys any of you have the mark jacobs omega bronzers that's how big this is it might be even a tiny bit bigger i'm not sure big pan and it has a really nice big mirror in here which i actually carry in my purse because i think it's great i'm just going to kind of do some of this across my cheekbones here so that you guys can see how pretty that is. It doesn't show my texture up. You know, of course, when we're older, we have to kind of stick to this outer area. We can't put it all over in here where we do have texture with large pores, but it's so pretty, you guys. I just think it's one of those ones that it catches the light and it's just not too much. And so that is one I would recommend. Don't throw away this plastic covering because it fits in there perfectly and that's gonna help it to stay a little bit fresh. And yes, some of you have said you'd never be able to use that in a million years as far as the Super Shock drying out. That's probably true, but I have been actually using it all over the place lately, like on my shoulders and stuff when they're bare. So I really have been enjoying that very much. And then I was gifted from For Forio, I think that's Forio. So, however you say that, I was gifted the Forio. This is the Luna 3, and I was gifted this through Octoly from Forio. And I really have been enjoying it. Now, I have never been one that used a Clarisonic or any sort of a brush or anything. I just feel like I really have enjoyed just having my microfiber cloths and I feel like I get a really good cleanse with that. But a couple of times a week I'll use this and I can feel that it's really going a lot deeper, very gentle. This is a very soft little nubby things on here. Um, and very fine. Hopefully you guys can see that. It works really well and it works on frequency. And the other thing that this particular one does is it hooks up to an app that you get and then you can uh, kind of manipulate the settings a little bit. And of course it's rechargeable and it just, it feels so good on the skin. And to be able to really, really get a deep cleanse. Um, some days I feel like I'm not quite cleansing enough or the product that I'm trying out at that particular time is not getting deep enough and this thing will go really deep. So and along with some skincare things, I want to once again talk to you guys about this germanium roller and it has these rollers in here that are like nubs and then this free rolls. And so you have that that free rolls, this part free rolls and you just hold that in your hand and it goes across your skin like this. 
I like this for a couple of reasons. I just had a video for you guys about my five favorite skincare tips for anti-aging and one of them was massage. This gives you a great massage along with cooling effects too. So I will really go over my neckline with this. I've been really diligent since I've lost all that weight because I was so afraid that my neck was going to get crepey and it is to a certain extent, my skin is saggy, but I find that if I use this a lot, it brings a lot of the blood up there. I'm using my college, I'm using my Retin-A to build collagen right there. And I really love this thing. So if you guys don't have one, it's not very expensive and you can get them off of Amazon and they have all different colors and stuff. But I just picked up one that was less expensive because I figured color didn't matter when I was only using it at night anyway. So I will use this around my eyes. I will use it in my cheekbones and around, you know, the top of the eyebrows and stuff. All, I actually use it all over. The best thing that I've found for it is if one, uh, my husband or my son has a headache, I can put this in the freezer for a few minutes and then give them a massage and it just helps move that lymph and helps bring the blood up and, you know, kind of moving everything around. So this has really been a lifesaver in more than just one way. So I really like that a lot. Another skincare item that I have been so impressed with you guys, I looked over a ton of things on Amazon to find something for my dry skin that was really good for the SPF. I've used mineral ones, I've used Neutrogena, Australian Gold, Nivea, Biore, I've used so many, but this one is one that I've been enjoying so much because it is a hydrating. So this is Skin Aqua. It's a Korean brand. It's an SPF of 50 plus 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 plus. And then it has the, it's called UV Super Moisture Milk. You can't get this in a bigger size, but since I was only trying it to see if I liked it, I got the smaller one. I will be repurchasing the bigger size, but absolutely no drying out. And I do put this all around my eyes because there's no drying out whatsoever. Ever. And I feel like, wow, this is, you know, going to give me the protection I need from the sun, but it's also going to not dry me out and not make me look like the crypt keeper underneath my eyes right there. So I really have been enjoying this a lot and I would really recommend it if you've been looking for one for your face and your neck and your chest area. I had a bunch of you tell me to try the number seven lift and illuminate triple action translucent translucent finishing powder and mine is in light and you guys were right this is a beautiful finishing powder i did my review on powders and all of you were like you got to try this one and i think that this one is so pretty now i will say that this one I don't like as much as I do like my Flower Beauty one, but it's it's like there. It's just really close. I think that I'm going to like this a lot more in the summer just because it's so light and so airy. And it does still have that creamy texture to it, but it doesn't feel like you've got a powder on at all. And I just love that about it. And I am wearing it today and I do feel like it gives a tiny bit of luminous look to it. Not really because I go in with my Milani Prep Set and Glow afterwards, which I'm hooked on, but this is a really nice setting powder as far as if you need areas to be matte. Like I get some breakthrough around my nose and on my chin. So wow, I really am thankful that you guys turned me on to that. Thank you so much. And then I wanted to touch on this briefly because this is the Good Molecules Overnight Exfoliating Treatment. I've recently had a lot of questions about these acids and how you use them and the leave-on acids for sensitive skin and different questions about that. Now, I really like this treatment. I think it's really good, but I am, as I get older, developing more and more sensitive skin. So if you have that kind of sensitive skin, instead of leaving it on overnight, use it like a mask. So go ahead and do all your cleansing and get your skin padded dry, and then go ahead and you know use this all over your face. You're gonna get some tingling initially. I always, always do. But what I do is I leave it on for about 10 minutes, and then I'll just take it off with a warm washcloth. And then I'll go on to do the rest of my skincare. And I find that I still get the exfoliating benefits from it. It, but I don't get as much irritation as I would if I left it on overnight. I have left it on overnight and it did fine, but I did notice, you know, that it did a lot more sloughing. So it really depends on how your skin is. If you're sensitive, dry, like I am, you might want to try that method of just using it like a mask. If you're not, then go ahead and use it as an overnight treatment. It's beautiful. I also want to touch on, I'm going to get close because guys, look at my eyelashes. I mean, 
honestly, my eyelashes are crazy insane and what they're doing the past two years has been crazy insane. And I know everybody asks me, do you wear false eyelashes? I don't. I don't wear any false eyelashes whatsoever. I just have these great lashes because of my ex lash. And I and have said this so many times, I feel like it's ad nauseum on my channel that I talk about X lash growth serum for eyelashes but this is so good and it has so many natural ingredients in it and i think that's why i enjoy it so much is because i wear contacts and i will go in and i will just put this on my top lash line i've started recently putting it on my bottom lash line which is making them grow like crazy but you don't have to so it just is a miracle solution as far as I'm concerned. I could not ever wear false eyelashes, even if I tried because of the disability with my shaking and my palsy and my hands. And so finding this has just been an absolute godsend as far as making my lashes look super long and super lush. And so I would highly recommend this to anybody. Everybody that has tried it on my recommendation has come back to me and said, you're right. You're absolutely right. So let me tell you just really quickly, you're not going to notice anything for about the first month. The first three to four weeks, you're going to be going, she's full of it. She doesn't even know what she's talking about. And then about the fourth week, maybe into the fifth week, you're going to go, are my lashes getting a little bit longer? Are they starting to grow? And then all of a sudden you're going to be like, whoa, I got lashes. They get a little bit thicker, but the biggest thing is they get really long because this helps them to grow long, helps um, really help them to lengthen their growth cycle because eyelashes and eyebrows have a quick turnover with their cycle. So this really helps give them lots of nourishment and lots of vitamins and lots of good things that help keep them healthy so that they can get as long as they possibly can before they do turn over and you have to, you know, grow a new eyelash. But I love this stuff and I won't be without it two years that I'm going on now and this stuff is really good. And I am going to put a before and after picture on my Instagram of what I did when I, before I started and how my eyelashes looked before I started this and how it looks now. And I think you guys will be really, really happy with the results if you try that one. Okay, I have a brush that I wanna share with you because I had so many of you say, Melissa, what do you use for your, br your blush in that blush video that I did this month of my favorite um, blushes? I had the cream blush in there or the Super Shock formula in there. And so many of you were like, what do you do? Well, this is what I do. I use this brush from It Cosmetics. I've had this brush for about six or seven years. It is a fantastic brush. It's an angled stipple brush. And the reason that I like it, it doesn't matter if it's powder, if it's cream. I love it for both of those. But the reason that I like it is- Because it is a duo fiber. These are super airy. So you're not going to deposit too much down at one, any one time. I just grabbed a super bright super shock formula for you guys so you can see. So this is probably my brightest blush that I have from them. And you can just kind of, you know, stipple down in it. You don't want to swipe it across because that's the defeating the purpose of having a stipple brush. And hopefully we can see what this is going to do. So it's going to go on there and it's going to give you, you know, you can build it up, you can keep it light, whatever you want to. But look how natural and how just beautiful that deposits it down. Now this is not a cheap brush, this is kind of an investment brush, but you guys, it is so worth it because it's not a brush that sheds. I've never had one single fiber come out of it and every single time I use it, I get the perfect blush application and I am in love with this thing. If I don't have this thing around, I almost panic because it is the only thing that I can find that goes across my cheeks. I got a hair in my face. The only thing I can find that goes across my cheeks and doesn't ever streak, doesn't ever lay down too much because, you know, I'm just, I'm just dabbing. I'm not, you know, pushing the blush across or trying to rub it in or anything. I'm just dabbing really lightly. And it just, it makes everything just look absolutely airbrushed and I can't, there's no other way to put it. So this particular, by the way, if you're interested in knowing, this one is Count Me In. <laughs> I wasn't planning on showing that, but that's what that blush is. It's count me in. And it just is a beautiful way of laying down your blushes, whether it's powder, whether it's cream, it doesn't really matter. That brush is going to do you good no matter what you put on. And I have one more thing to share with you, and it is a hair clip. I got this recently from Amazon after I was um, looking on Amazon for all that jewelry that I was showing you guys and linking it. And this is a peacock. And so here's the peacock's head right here. Hopefully I can get close enough 
you can see. So it. here is the peacock's head right here, and then the you know, the feathers that go up here, and it's so pretty. So I'm going to wear some buns, and then I'm going to put this just right below it, and I think it will be so gorgeous in the hair. So I think it's absolutely beautiful. They have tons of these. I will link this one and a few others so you can see. They have a turquoise one that I absolutely fell in love with, and um, some different shapes and different types not just the peacock one but i thought this was so pretty so that's it for february favorites i hope that you guys did enjoy this video thank you so very much for tuning in today let me know if you guys had any lifestyle household makeup skincare any favorites this month i would love to hear that from you guys i always love your recommendations and try them out and i've found so many good things and i appreciate you guys sharing all those with me thank you for tuning in spending a bit of your time with me hope everybody is doing really well and the sun is shining where you're at because it is shining where i am and it always makes me feel better you guys take care of yourselves love you so very much and i will catch you all in my next video bye you guys <laughs>